press L to pee! I... Uh, I hate you so much. Hello everyone, welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Crystal. It's been a long time since I last recorded and I'm really sorry, but I blame Cena Blair Chronicles. <laughs> Anyways, um, in the last part, we uh, got through this route. I had to redo this entire recording again because because I forgot to save the, in the last episode. So I'm back here again, don't worry about it. And uh, and um, I've asked you guys to like, cast your three Pokemon, and most of you guys said yes. So I guess I'll be using this as my team. And it's I'm the flower shop's floor, yeah. Listen, listen. When I sprinkle water on a willy tree, it jumps right up. It just has to be a Pokemon. I bet if it will be shot down the skies if you, sh if you soaked it, I know I'll let you. I let my sis. Uh, I grabbed Gagne and didn't realize that said there. Borrow her water bottle. Okay, so we go back to her sis. And. I guess I'd go back to. to, to Goldenrod now. I'll see you guys over there, okay? Okay, and we're back in Goldenrod City. Um, so basically, where, gonna, where I want to go is over here. Into this house and talk to you. La 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 uh, I'll see you guys back to the tree. Oh, back to the tree again. So, anyways, and now I'm going to go over here and I'm going to save just in case something goes wrong. Okay? Just in case something goes wrong. Okay? And we're going to talk to the tree. The weird tree, you squirt bottle? Yes. Okay, so you squirt bottle. Weird tree doesn't like the squirt bottle. The weird tree attacked. This would be pretty interesting. And uh, the, the, the tree pole one I've been referring to in the last episode is no other than Pseudo Widow. Check that hip. <laughs> and it was, um. So Pseudo Widow is a rock and ground type, I think. I can't, it's my last look at Pseudo Widow, but. This is the only one you can catch in the game, so if you, you might want to be careful to catch it. So, uh. We'll go for a confusion, see. Hopefully, I won't do too much damage. Oh. That's, that's, that's alright. Okay, you're confused. Okay, I'll start chucking the Pokeballs at you now. Okay, don't do too much damage. That's alright. Nope, not there. Okay, um... Open. Uh, we'll try to use Great Ball because we have a bit easier to catch it in. I don't want to risk it, so don't. Well, again, the Great Ball. One, two, three. That was probably the easiest time I've actually caught through the window in. Anyways, um... Truth be told, I already had like 5 LPs um, named before I started this LP. Like, it was going to use, and I was trying to figure out who it would use for the last one, but I think I've got a good suggestion, so I have for this one, which says was in the comments for the last episode. So, let's see if I can say it right, hopefully. I think that's right. Yeah, and as this is uh, this one named after Midnight and Beyond, you might remember him from um, a few episodes ago. He was co commentated with me on this LP, and uh, this series was named after him. It's because he's the illusion Pokemon, apparently. It's just, uh, okay, so it's, it's just Rock then? Okay, that's alright. I'm, I'm okay with this. Uh, so it does have like, good attack and defense. Uh, special defense isn't too bad. Speed, it's a bit low, and special attack doesn't really matter at the stage in this game, really, because. Well, I'm gonna put fast attacks on you, anyways. Um, do I have any good TMs I can teach you? No. <laughs> okay, I'll just leave that there. I, I, I got there for now, anyways. And as today is Thursday, so we're going to go and do the bug catching contest and show that off. So basically, what you want to do is just go into here and uh, talk to one of these guys. Hello. Today's Thursday. That means the bug catching contest is on today. The rules are simple. Using one of your Pokemon, catch a bug Pokemon to be judged. Would I to give it a try? Yes. Uh oh. You have more than one Pokemon. You have to use smooch him. The first Pokemon in your party. Is that okay? Yeah, sure. Okay, if I hold on to Pokemon when you compete. It's okay. Here are the park balls for the contest. We received 20 park balls. Alright. The person who gets the strongest book Pokemon is the winner. You have 20 minutes. If you run out of park balls, you're done. You can keep the last Pokemon you catch as your own. Go ahead and catch the strongest book Pokemon you can find. Alright. So basically, in the book catching contest, we basically have uh, 20 minutes to catch... Trying to find a Pokemon that we want to come this So, 
Yeah. Uh, mostly what you'll be finding here is like Weedles. Uh, not, there's not many really good Pokemon in here you can get really. Let's try to... Like Weedles, you can get Matapods like, so... Um, there's just a couple of Pokemon I got there, but there is some rare Pokemon I didn't catch. I'm just trying to find here if I can speed this up. Nice, like, like here! Pinsir! Uh, <coughs> these are actually here in the book catching, on the book catching contest. Pinsir, um... I've actually never used Pinsir before. So I have oh, I'll, I'll see if I can catch one to say get... So I can make the old one. Uh, the judging of us here is based on how much L or how much um, HP is left of the opponent, which I probably lost this year because of that there. Um, basically, this, the, the level of Pokemon you caught and basically the Pokemon you caught. So it is. Uh, see if I can catch it anyways. Okay, for every park balls I do. No. Oh, jeez. Oh wow. <laughs> I had to wait it out. That was pretty embarrassing. Okay, I caught nothing anyway, so yeah, we've chosen the winners. Are you ready for this? Place in third with Jonas Samuel, he caught Pinsir. Uh, scores 28 points, 23 points. We got Josh, he caught Scyther. Josh Jackson is now a bug catcher, huh? <laughs> but bug can catch Nick, he caught Scyther. Yeah, I suppose you can catch a Scyther in here so you can. I would have caught a Scyther if I was if I could able to, if I was able to evolve it, but I can't because I can't treat everyone. Is Mitchum fainted or? No, it's okay. Uh, I guess we'll just head on then. I think I'm. If I'm not mistaken, you can heal up in the PC, can you? If I'm not mistaken. I can fire them midnight so good and then hopefully I'll heal up. And they will. I don't know if it will or not. Oh, oh, back, 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 back. I don't know if that heals up or not. Oh, it does! Sweet! I was right about the PC truck. Okay, so um, I guess we'll use Midnight, and um, we'll head on the next time then. So we at the front. Okay, let's get going. So, basically, now that we did that there... Um, oh, I, I've actually forgot about something. I, had to, I, had to, I want to zoom back, back here. I forgot about something. Completely important. I just realized this here, and I'm an idiot. You're on back here. Random counters don't like you. Run back here, go down here, across here, down here, talk to this here guy over here. Excuse me, kid, can you do a guy a favor? Can you take this Pokemon of mail to my friend? He's number 31. You will? Perfect, thanks, kid. The house a chubby guy who snoozes all the time. You need to recognize him straight away. You can't. Ah! Uh, I don't like speed up sometimes because it really does. It just. You, like, you overshoot where you're walking tonight, like, like, quite a lot of times, you know? I'll just fire someone in the PC just for now, anyways, because those won't take too long, I guess. Uh, we'll fire in. Uh. Da -da -da. We'll fire in Pico, I guess, for now, because he's fully evolved anyway. Okay. Where we go again? Let's go yet again. Move out of the right place. Back up to the top again. Okay, into here. I'll talk to you again. Okay, you're saying the same thing again. Yes. You're all perfect, thanks, kid. Pass job, you guys, news is all the time. You're working straight away. So receive a Pokemon with meal, okay. You read it, but don't lose it. Read 31. Oh yeah, there's weird traded block on the road. I wonder if it's been cleared. The strange thing is, why do they give you a Pokemon with meal? Why is giving the meal instead? That I have no idea, but so you get a Sparrow called Kenya. Don't ask me why it's called Kenya, I don't really know. <coughs> but um, basically we just deliver this guy to Route 31, which we actually are going to end up going to in about two seconds actually. Back up to where that where Suda Widow was, uh, so we're gonna quickly head over here, cut, cut that down, go across here, go up to here, and talk to you. Do you hear that wretched tree? I'm impressed, I want to get, I want you to have this. We can tame away it. And this is Rock Smash. You can shatter rocks with a single well aimed smack. If any rocks are in your way, just smash them up. Okay. So I think that my Paris can learn Rock Smash. I hope we can. This is a TM this game, and on the other games, it is it is a um a HM, so uh, yeah. But never mind. It was the guy we're going to go to it is not in this area route, but if we go back, back this way, go all the way down this way, go back over here, this is back to Bad City, of course. It's Route 31, we'll talk to this guy. Huh? What's that? Do you have me with me? So we give him Kenya. Okay, let's see. Dark Cave leads to another road. That's good to know. Thanks for bringing this to me. My friend's a good guy, and you're swell too. I like you to do some. I like to do something good in return too. 
I know, I want you to have this. We get TM50. TM50, I think, is Dream Eater? Is it? No, Nightmare. So, well, let's make a move that Sally cuts the HP of Sleeping Enemy. Oh, that's scary. I don't want to have bad dreams. Uh, basically, that won't be very useful to me because I don't have any sleeping moves, so. Unfortunately, I won't, I won't be able to use it. I think he takes Cannon off your party, does he? Yeah, he does. So, I'll have to bring back Pico into the party. So, it'll take too long, anyways. Speed up for the win. Okay, let's go into this PC. Uh, access PC, go into Bill's PC, withdraw. Pico, alright. Let's get out of here, Ian, okay. Oh, hang on, back. Alright, we go, and forward. Um, onwards, please. There we go. Back over here, Ian. Can we go this way, please? There we go. Right, now we continue on the story. <laughs> okay, Um. so we're going to go up this route. Let's talk to Sane. Are we, are we the same? Can't talk to Sane. Trader tips. Use Dick to return to the entrance of any place. It's convenient for exploring caves and other landmarks. Okay. We have a battle over here. Anne and I are in this together. Okay, whatever. Alright, uh, let's bring it on, you twins. Uh, if this was hard to go so silver, it's been a double battle, but double battles weren't invented by this time. So we have, so we have a Jigglypuff to fight. Let's try at midnight then for our first for, for our first time. We'll give it a rock through. And, ooh, almost KO'd you. Almost. Pound. Not very effective. I laugh at your pound. We'll give you a low kick. Not probably the better option, actually. <laughs> but whatever. Okay. Uh, Clefairy, you know, it's gonna keep midnight out there. Uh, Zubat actually evolves next level, so I might use, um, so I might use, um, Batman night, so I might. Oh, come on, really? Okay, that shouldn't do too much damage. Yeah. Give, well, let's give a low kick, and hopefully that'll just KO you, or feed you, whatever, I don't know. Critical hit, super effective, you're down. But yes, I might use these Batman items to get him leveled up so he can evolve. Okay, and then a little too strong. Yeah, you're weak. Okay, that's like, okay, we get, we get, we get a Batman now. Gates get him evolved, I guess, alright? Okay, and, uh, yeah. Hello. Pokemon can't do a thing if they're asleep. I'll show you how scary that is. Alright, let's bring it on then, you. Sega Greg! Sounded drowsy! Let's be good for Batman because of bait! Happy days! Okay, let's get bait going on the go then. Wow, that didn't hardly anything. <coughs> Sorry. Dry throat here. It's a little bit hard to speak sometimes when you have dry throat. Okay, you flinched. That's not, that's not too bad. Hopefully, come on, Batman. Come on. Aw, oh, really? Okay, that's, that's... This is working fine. Yay! We win! And... Bob on these a bit more experience points. I lost, that's pretty sad. Well, I'm pretty happy. So, I don't, I don't, I don't really care. Okay, let's check these here. Trees here, we got a red apricorn. Apricorn, apricorn, whatever. I don't really care. Red, we got a... Blue one here. And we get a black one here. Or BLK. Okay, ah. Uh, Wrong encounters, really? Really? We got it here, alright. Okay, and up we go. And this is the next town. After this random encounter. Uh, Growlithe, I don't really care. Okay. Up we go. This is Ukritik City. Or Ukritik City. Uh, we'll, explore, we'll explore this place in the next episode, but I think if we go out this way, I think we might be able to find our last Pokemon out here. I think we might be able to. I hope he will, but um, people say there's hair cross and he's here chasing the head buttons, so I'll give it a wee go, so I will, and um, if I find one, I'll cut to it, but I'll give it a five minutes, so will, okay? So i cut to a random counter then, I guess? Okay, I've had no joy of finding one, so I haven't. I'll keep searching around, so I will, and hopefully I'll get one on camera, if I can. I'll just keep looking around, see how, see where people catch hair crosses in this area, because, like, it, Paracross is really rare Pokemon like Fang to is and uh, Wild to is and but he's a very very good Pokemon so I'm really hoping I can find one. But never mind, um I'll I guess I'll just leave it off here. Uh, excuse me, this will be one press out of the P and welcome um I'm walking back. Uh 
Thank you for watching this episode, and I will see you guys next time when we go explore Equity City and hopefully find a hard cross. I'll see you guys later. So long.